Okay, hey guys, today is Wednesday, so today I'll be teaching the Pharaoh and Riffle Shuffle. These are two commonly used shuffles in most card magic. Um, I use these a lot. And some kids are actually really impressed by them because they can't do them. So let's go ahead and get into the Riffle Shuffle. Do what I'm going to show you. This is actually what it should look like. This is what I'm going to be teaching you, okay? So I'm going to show you a few angles and give you some pointers on how to left-handed or right-handed, whichever you want, okay? What you'll do is you can do this the way I do it, okay? So what you do is get this deck in mechanics. First, you get in mechanics grip, then you get into the one-handed fan grip, okay? Basically, if you don't know what the one-handed fan grip is, it's basically a... Vertical straddle grip. This is straddle grip. This is a vertical straddle grip. Okay, basically your middle finger and your ring finger are on the bottom of the cards. Your thumb is on the opposite edge. Okay, so that's what it seems should look like. Now on the two longer sides, you're gonna have your pointer finger and your pinky. Okay, so what you'll do is you'll get control of it by what you'll do. Is you'll take your pointer finger from the side and curl it and put it on the back right there. Okay on the edge or in the middle doesn't matter what you'll do is you'll bring your other hand right here you'll bring it up to the tip like this see and what you'll do is you'll riffle off like this so riffle about middle okay and then when your pointer finger put it in the slit right there and rotate it down so now it's living on these three fingers and these three fingers and then just rotate it over like that okay so once you do that have it, rotate it, and get it in the same grip, okay? Now you should have two one-handed fans in each hand, okay? Grip. What you'll do is you'll curl both index fingers, put them on the back, okay? Now, in keeping this same grip, what you'll do is you'll curl your pinkies into your hands, like right here, okay? Just to keep a grip on the corners, on the edges. Basically what you'll do is do the riffle, same thing, and weave them together. So look, watch. You'll keep the cards in mid-air basically because you're putting them together like so, but also because these two fingers, their pointer and your ring finger and middle, middle finger are holding it. So they can't drop, see? So what you'll do is you'll get the riffle going. If you need to practice that, just put your pointer fingers on the back and then riffle it, okay? So what you'll do is you can drop one card if you want, just riffle off one. Put your, here's how you'll shuffle. Take your thumbs that will be at an angle at the corners for a riffle. What you'll do is you'll put the knuckles, the big knuckles together like that basically, so you can get ready and then just bend them like that. So now it's all ready for it. Got this grip. Basically what you'll do is you'll riffle both sides. Riffle, and they'll start to weave. Now, once you're done with it, you'll bring the pointer finger over on bottom. So now all four fingers, your pointer, ring, middle, and pinky should all be on the bottom and your thumb should be on top. Now how do you arch it? Basically what you do, is you put your thumbs in the center, okay? Then you apply pressure on both sides with these four fingers, okay? You push up on those corners, up and into your fingers, curl them, and then push them together. Once you curl up, push them together, and then just drop. Drop your fingers. That's all you gotta do, so watch. Like this. Knuckles together. Riffle. Curl in like that. Here's a here's a first person view for y'all. Riffle with your fingers, okay. Now what you'll do is you'll hold it like so with your pointer fingers curled, okay, like this, and you will touch those. If you can't keep them together, they'll come apart a little bit, don't worry. 
Now these are weaved together and you're holding it like that so they ain't gonna fall, okay? Now what you'll do is bend up, bend up, burn, push up and curl so it curves and then just push them like that which will cause them to do that. So here's your final product. And that is your basic riffle midair shuffle. Basically what the shuffle is for is for doing tricks like on the street, for your friends at school, whatever. It's just basically a way to do a little flashy like so. Okay, that's all you gotta do. Just follow the simple steps, rewind if you need to, comment if you need more detail. Um, this isn't really all that hard. Um, most people do it on their legs. That's why I showed you this tutorial, so I can do it up in midair. It's not that hard once you get a hold of it, but you'll get little clumps like this. Okay. It'll be kind of uneven for a little bit, but once you keep working with it, it will be fine. I promise you. Now, this is a very simple trick or flourish to shuffle the cards and you can control it however you need to. So I hope you all enjoyed this little tutorial. And so, now, you may enjoy the Pharaoh Shuffle.